And look this way. Look this way. Look this way. <laughs> look at Kobe. Still looking at the phone and shit. FG Radio DJ Kobe, we back in this thing once again. Season two, finally back or back again. Been telling y'all we was gonna come back. Finally back, got the music playing and all that. In here as usual, my man Tom. What up, though? And we got a special guest today, the first female rapper or artist to come on the show. You know, kicking off Ladies Appreciation Month. Got Miss Soli in the building. What's up? What's up? All right, now tell the people where they can get at you up. Um, you can follow me on Twitter at S O L underscore underscore L E. Um, you can follow my Tumblr, I am solely dot Tumblr dot com. Um, Instagram, S O L underscore L E. All right, now I met you, what, like, uh, probably like summertime of last year. I think we was opening up the Turk, something like that. Yeah. Out of the yak. You gave me a CD, and the first thing I did, I looked at it, and I was like, man, she did this art before I even read everything. I was like, she did this art. <laughs> yeah. So, like, right then, I was like, all right, I'm going to listen to this. But then you perform, and the shit was actually dope. And I say actually dope because a lot of time, you know what I'm saying, there's usually only two types of female rappers. You got, you know, Lil' Kim or you got Lady of Rage, you know, the real hard or the real soft, but, like, Goddamn, but the shit was dope. Like it was bars, and you had energy and everything. People was rocking with you. But when I took your CD home, I sat on that bitch for the longest. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but then I finally listened to it. The shit was crack. I fuck with. I think what it was nine tracks on it. The uh, what what was it called? Uh, Imagination Proclamation. Yeah. I fuck with eight out of nine out of there. So, how did you come up with the whole concept of how to put that together? Well, I was just trying to find like something that like was true to me and I had like a crazy imagination when it comes to like writing music or just thinking about life period like I got a different way that I look at life mm -hmm. and people were not really open to that and to me I look at it as creativity and being free and so I thought of uh, emancipation proclamation and I thought about just imagination proclamation okay. like my proclamation there is just you know have my imaginary my imagination, you know, so I came up with that, and um, I had a couple tracks done by Sheaf. My cousin did a beat. I did some like beatboxing with my other cousin, who produced a couple beats, G beats, and then it just came together and I put all those tracks on there. All right, now uh, you working on a project now? Uh, yes, Booger Sugar. Booger Sugar. Yeah. <laughs> Like cocaine? Yeah, like cocaine. All right, we gonna, uh, <laughs> we gonna get back to this music right quick. Uh, we actually about to play one of your joints, uh, Bad Attitude. So tell us a little bit about uh, Bad Attitude. Uh, that's just uh, like me telling my story, like the personal things and conquers that I had to get over and come through. And I just wanted to tell people like, you gonna have a bad attitude at, when you mad at me about stuff, but you can't even look at yourself and see what you've done. So to have an attitude with me, you better put some manners on that attitude. It's like, <laughs> check yourself, you know? And that's pretty, pretty much. All right, well, uh, here go. Bad Attitude by Soul Leo, FG Radio. FG Radio back in this thing. DJ Kobe. Still here, my man Tone. What up, though? And So Lee. Now, uh, Tone, you got shoes for us this week? Yes. It's been a long time since I've done this. Yeah. Got to get back into it, man. You know, been gone for months on months. A shout out to everybody who picked up the uh, the Black History Month pack this week. It was the Brown 11s and the KD6s. Um, that was about it. That's dropped recently. Well, within the last week. Uh, the Jordans opened a store, like first Jordan only store. Yeah, I've seen in New uh, York. NBA on Instagram yeah. shit. Foot action. Um, it's basically like a foot action, but just Jordan everything. 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 That's all they told you. Just Jordan. Jordan. Yeah. All Jordan Damn. products. But do they sell like the shit that people want, like, or is it like Team Jordan shit? This is the thing. It's they probably gonna release J's on release date and all that. But it's Team Jordan. But you know, know once those sell out. You know, it's really not nice, special in there they selling. Yeah. Uh, today, uh, Foot Action did a restock on the Bread 11s and the Low Top uh, 11s, the white and black ones. Uh, it's probably sold out by now, but you know, it was like a Super Bowl restock or something like that. 
we got on Friday. Oh, I'm sorry, not Friday. On Wednesday, the DC uh, KD Sixes is dropping, like a white, red, and um, blue, blue color line. Uh, the Miami Heat gloves is releasing on the six. The all red ones. Uh, when he played for Miami, we got the Brown Eleven Atomic Orange dropping on the seventh. The V Day questions, fuck Reebok like always. You don't like them? On the Those dope as fuck. <laughs> but they don't come in nigga sizes. <laughs> okay, so yo, fuck uh, fuck Reebok, fuck Reebok again. The A, the Tiffany Dunks is releasing. That's a big release. Uh, the Phone Pro Spider Man is releasing on the eighth. Fuck Nike for fucking up phones. What they do to the phones? It's like a extra now. It's not, you know. You're talking about as far as like the camouflage yeah. and all that shit. I want to go on the record and say I never fucked with the phones. And if you look at old FG Radio episodes, I've been saying phones yeah. was phones was dope at first. It's just now it's just going beyond. Yeah. And it's too many. Like they release them twice a month now. It's, yeah. it's crazy. Not even exclusive. Next, huh. no Saturday the V Day uh sixes for Jordan is releasing. They uh silver and pink if I'm not mistaken. Kobe. Yeah, I know. The, uh, Is them coming out of nigga side? No. What Jordan? Yeah. Uh, the Kobe Nines is releasing on the eighth. I haven't seen them. Haven't they seen fucking them. horrible. They mm-hmm. like Manny Pacquiao boxing shoes. Uh, next week, <clears throat> the All Star Pack is releasing. It's the Bronze. Kobe's, if I'm not mistaken, and KD Sixes. The boxing Kobe's or boxing Kobe's, yeah. The White Infrareds is releasing on the 15th, and the Toro 6 is releasing on the 15th. I gotta see these codes you're talking about. Oh, they horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Back to Solis. <laughs> now, uh, explain your style to us. It's really unpredictable, to be honest. Like Yeah, because I was looking at your videos and everything. Everyone, you know, there's no, you, you never know. Yeah, and my videos don't even show it for real, like. Like every time, really, like on my video shoots, I always like something happened like right before the video shoot to where I can't get the right outfits how I want to, so I have to really throw some shit together and like so make it work. Improvise. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Mainly just improvising it. I, I don't even have to get nothing high fashion. I go to a thrift store, uh, buy a resale store, and just, you know, put some shit together, man. No. For less than $20. <laughs> no, I was doing my research and a birdie told me that you was fired over some Jordans or something <laughs> like that. Okay, yeah. So I have these, uh, it was these, the Laney Fives that came out. I took a picture of them and I posted them. Like, the, you know, just, you know, to show like these bitches coming out, them, they hot. And I don't know, an employee hated on me. So they took the, uh, they snapshot the picture and then sent it to my manager. So my manager, he don't even want to fire me, you know what I'm saying? Because we talking, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay, cool, man. It's just, you got to do what you got to do, man, as a manager, to, you know, hold your position. They kind of like threaten his his position as yeah. a manager. So, you know what I'm saying? He had to do what he had to do. Just fire me, man, you know what I'm saying? And I just took the L. I still got, you know, still get the just for the so L. So they fired you just for taking a picture? Just for taking a picture. And then what made it worse is I was, you know, dealing with employees and shit and the employees, like, they were, like, offended by me. Like, that that was foul. That was foul. I'm like... All you do is take a picture. Yeah. No, okay. What made it worse, right? What did the caption say? Okay, no. It was just, like, <laughs> just the Laney Fives coming out or something like that. Nothing about selling them. But when I got fired, no one knew I got fired. So, I had end up start selling the tickets. Because, you know, they got to get... They pass out tickets now for the Jays. Yeah. So, I used to just wait in line with a couple of my little cousins. We'll get the Jays. I mean, we'll get the tickets for the Jays. And then I'll sell them for, like... A hundred dollars, you know, yeah. and that was making money. So when I put the tickets online, they thought I got fired for selling the tickets. So they thought like that was something so foul. Oh. Okay. So I had to snap on, you know, had to snap on a couple employees and stuff. Like, the fuck? Like, are you fucking villa? Like, <laughs> what the, like, get the fuck? Like that killed me. Like you know, so I hate when people. I know it's like off subject, but I Hang hate out. you know, so I hate <laughs> no for real. Like I hate when people. You know, try to defend corpor- a corporation, not no shots out, no shots out to corporations, you know what I'm saying? I just hate when they defend a corporation and they can't, they can't even pay their bills, you know what I'm saying? They getting these minimum wage, at, minimum wage ass checks and shit and can't afford to take care of their kid because Villa only giving you $7 an hour instead of just going out and being talented and just, you know, making money off your talents and 
feeding with your community and helping with your fa you know family and black people and your homies and everything and really mm -hmm. doing something, you know, what the fuck? Not speak. Don't my come on me about that shit because I'm making money. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> like that's a legit way to make money. Niggas, niggas is come. You know what I'm saying? Niggas with money, drug dealers, all type of niggas that want them J's. They'll pay a hundred to two hundred to yeah. three hundred for a ticket. To like that's they, if they want, it's their right to pay for that ticket. Why can't I sell it? If they gonna pay for buy that shit, you know what I'm saying? All right, I'm gonna get off subject, man. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> that, that just pissed me off when she told me that. Like try to defend me from selling some tickets. <laughs> All right, but you was talking about uh, talking about the creativity or whatever. Now you down with the uh, talk crew? And yeah, people that don't know what that is. The it's T A C. T A yeah. The uh, now people don't know what that is. That's the air up there. Mm -hmm. Now that's a group of creatives. So explain your position amongst those. Um. Well, they like like my brothers. Like how I met Shifi. You know, I was like researching the different people. Uh, I know you know Ro. That's, that's the homie. Um, I was like, like trying to find out like who who is who in the game. Like who can I get connected to? Who can I meet to like, you know what I'm saying? Show me something. You know, put me on. Show me, point me in the right direction. Put, connect me with this person. So I looked up videographers because I wanted to do a music, music video. I seen Ro videos. He had some dope videos. So I hit him up. Um, I heard Shifi did artwork. I started watching his uh, videos on YouTube, the TAUT uh, shows, volume, I don't even know, like, I don't know, one of his volumes and shit. Yeah. And I'm like, damn, that shit live. You know what I'm saying? Who is this nigga? You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I got some artwork done by him, the Imagination Proclamation cover, and then uh, got some beats from him, and then we just started networking. I started cutting this hair, and then... We we've been the crew since, you know. You did perm for him? No, I ain't do the perm for him. I, I, I fade him up every now, every now and then. Me and his pops. We about to uh, we about to play another one of y'all joints, the uh, short dog. Oh yeah, short dog. <laughs> so uh, tell us about short dog before we get to, get into that. Uh, fuck these hoes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like for real, that's really really come down to not women, these hoes. You know what I'm saying? These hoes. So that's pretty much. What LG Radio DJ Kobe back in this thing once again, my man Tone. What up, though? And still in here with Sully. What's good? All right. Uh, now tell us about this Burger Sugar project. Uh, this is my new project. A little, a little more edgier. Um, a little more confident than my last, my last project. It's just growth. And I feel like, you know, the reason why I named it Booger Sugar is like a lot of people claiming that they crack and they crack, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I ain't just crack, I'm pure, like, you know what I'm saying? You just, you can't water this down. And I just came up with the concept of cocaine. And I just thought of a clever name, Booger Sugar, everybody knows what that means. Right. But, you know, it's more geared to like my music, you know, not necessarily cocaine at all, really. Now when it's dropping? Uh, I really haven't had a date yet. I'm, I'm debating on when it's gonna drop winter. I'm I'm debating between February and March though. Late February, early March. You got a single that you're pushing or um use it's a just fan. Not first. Uh use a fan. I'm pushing that one. Uh the intro that I'm definitely know is gonna be the intro is called Energy. Um I got a couple other dope tracks I'm pushing for singles. It's gonna have a lot of dope videos this year. Like it's gonna be way more production and product. Y'all gonna see me a lot more this year. Like two thousand fourteen is like our year like so you're gonna see a lot more of me a lot more videos now like i said you're the first female rapper out here so of course i gotta ask you to rap so you know i'm saying i'm gonna drop a beat you know and i'm gonna just let you do your thing from there all right okay cool all right okay I'm so sexy, no correction. Don't you see your man's erection? Don't you bring that bullshit in my direction? Father, please forgive me for my flaws and imperfections. Can't recall how many times I'm resurrected. Sometimes I act reckless, subconsciously I know it. I'm terrible with money, when it's in my hand I blow it. The way I bounce back, another man will never show it. It's something about the music, it just make me get heroic. Don't get me on that real shit, have me sounding like a poet. Step on stage and kill it, leave these rappers closing curtains. Murder competition, any rapper is a target, a bargain. Bitch, I'm above the margin, T-A-U-T squadron. Stand out or die until... I don't know, you know what I'm saying, I don't know. <laughs> we got a little off track right there. Go pick yeah. me up or uh, that's all you got. 
I'm that's all I'm gonna give you. That's all I'm gonna give you. That's all I got. That's all I'm gonna give you. All right, now tell the people where they can get at you. Uh, yeah, on Twitter, S O L underscore underscore L E, Instagram, S O L underscore L E, and um, Tumblr, S I M Soli dot Tumblr dot com. All right, and Tom, hit me up at Prince underscore McFly. <laughs> drop the Y at the E I. All right, you can hit me up at DJ underscore Kobe on Twitter, hashtag that FG Radio. Follow the team. Uh, Shelby, you know how Shelby do. She comes, she want to come. So, you know, hit her up at what? Shelby Lee, L-E-I-Q-H underscore. Follow FG Radio at FG Radio M-I. Hit us up on YouTube, youtube.com slash FG Radio Live. FGRadio.Podomatic.com. It's a lot of shit, man. Uh, we just got an Instagram. We just got an Instagram. F- under, FG underscore radio. Yep, that shit. Uh, follow Ro at R O W E shot me. Is that everything? I think that's it. Yeah, that's yeah it. man.